Our medication for today is atrovastatin. The second I say statin, you should already be thinking that this must be a HMG-CoA reductase inhibitor, right? All of these statins are going to be these HMG-CoA reductase inhibitors. All right, so what's the trade name of this drug? The trade name is Lipitor. And these drugs are given for the management of high cholesterol, also known as hypercholesterolemia, and the primary prevention of cardiovascular disease. So once we know a patient is at risk for cardiovascular disease or stroke, also we can give these HMG CoA reductase inhibitors to try to prevent the buildup of this plaque and this, this cholesterol within the arteries, okay? So again, this is Lipitor, and the indication is going to be management of high cholesterol and primary prevention of cardiovascular disease. So how does it actually work? Atrovastatin and these other statins, they actually work by lowering total cholesterol as well as LDL while slightly increasing HDL. Remember, we have these different types of cholesterol. We have our HDLs, which are actually good cholesterol. And so what these uh, statins can actually do is they can actually help to increase our levels of HDL just a little bit. How does it actually work? What it does, it actually inhibits this HMG-CoA reductase. And what HMG-CoA reductase is, it's actually something in the liver that plays a role in cholesterol formation while we sleep. And so what we usually do is we give these medications before the patient goes to sleep at night, and it actually inhibits this HMG-CoA reductase, and so that we aren't producing as much cholesterol. Okay, so therapeutic class is lipid-lowering agent. Okay, you think statin, you think in lipids, and these statins are going to lower are lipids, okay? Pharmacological class is HMG CoA reductase inhibitor. So we have Lipitor, we have, uh, which is atrovastatin, we have simvastatin, we have rosuvastatin or Crestor. The medication we, we give a lot on uh, neuro ICU, a lot of times we have patients come in with stroke, and so as we're preparing to send these patients home, um, and as, we're, as part of their stroke management, we put them on a statin. We, a lot of times we'll put them on a rosuvastatin, which is Crestor. So some, some of the things you're gonna want, to, going to want to look out for with these patients, some of our nursing considerations are that it's going to be contraindicated in acute liver disease or active liver disease. It may cause rhabdomyolysis. What, and maybe you haven't seen rhabdomyolysis. It's not an incredibly common uh, condition, but what it is, is it's actually um, the breakdown of muscle fibers. And these patients with rhabdo, they get very, very sick. Some of the symptoms are going to be incredibly dark urine. We call it coke urine, like it looks like coke, muscle weakness and fatigue, and they can also have uh, neurological changes. So these statins can actually lead to statin-induced rhabdomyolysis. So you really want to watch your patient's urine, muscle weakness, fatigue, things like that in a patient who's taking a statin. Not a very common side effect, but something to look out for. We're going to also want to, mo want to monitor renal function. We're going to monitor serum cholesterol levels before we start the medication, about four weeks after, and then frequently during therapy. Why are we doing that? Well, we just want to see if the medication is actually working, right? We don't want to start them on something, forget about it, let it go, never check on it again, right? What we do is we put them on the, the uh, atrovastatin, we put them on the statin, and we monitor their cholesterol level. Is it working? Is it lowering? Uh, and where are we at with that? This has been another episode of the Med Master Podcast brought to you by medmastercourse.com and nrsng.com. My name is John Haas, RN, CCRN, student nurse mentor, and your biggest fan. If you're ready to demolish nursing pharmacology once and for all, head over to medmastercourse.com and use the coupon code PODCAST to save 15% on lifetime membership to MedMaster Course. The MedMaster Course is packed full of 30 plus hours of HD video and audio content with tons and tons of free cheat sheets and downloads. Demolish nursing pharmacology, never guess a med again. Go to medmastercourse.com, coupon code podcast. You guys know what time it is now. Go out and do something great. Happy nursing. Happy nursing.